everyone this is Rina and in today's video I am going to tell you about a very simple very effective DIY fruit facial. I have been using this fruit facial for almost one month and the results are really amazing. I am really amazed by the result. It deals with lots of skin problem. Basically I started using because of my these pigmentation mark here and I can see the difference that they start kind of fading. Uh, apart from this DIY facial, I have been using other remedies to deal with this pigmentation mark that I will do in some other video. But today I'm going to tell you about this super simple DIY fruit facial that you can do at your home using very simple ingredient. And uh, the result, I think you will see yourself. For this facial, we will need half lemon, one tablespoon granulated sugar, and one teaspoon honey half banana if it is overripe that that's okay and a grater so first of all I'm squeezing some lemon juice in the sugar and putting some sugar on the lemon and then rubbing this lemon with the sugar on my face it will act as an exfoliator and it will remove all the dead skin from your face and I'm doing this for 10 to 15 minutes in the beginning you can do it for 5 to 8 minutes but it would be better if you can stretch it up to 10 minutes time to time taking more sugar when the sugar dissolves and rubbing in in circular motion and once it's all done I'm leaving it to dry now once it dried, I am going to wash my face with lukewarm water and now I will prepare the fresh banana mix. So first I am squeezing out all the juice from the lemon and now I am grating the banana. The paste should be fine so that's why I am grating it otherwise the lump remains. So the better way is to grate it with a fine grater and now I am going to add 1 teaspoon of honey. And I'm going to mix it very well so now I'm applying this paste with my fingers on my face and we are going to do the facial massage using this banana pulp for 10 to 15 minutes and the massage should be very gentle we should not give hard pressure otherwise skin will turn red the purpose of this is not to turn our face red just to feed this banana into our skin so this will be done by very gentle pressure with the finger, very gentle movement with the fingertips. And I am using different stroke, strokes of facial massage, all in upward direction. Using circular motion and all stroke will go in upward direction. And another thing that I like to mention is that we can use different fruit instead of banana. We can use strawberry, apple, papaya, kiwis. So all these fruit are very good for our skin. And I have used only banana till now and the results are so far good. So I am just sticking to banana. Maybe in future I will try papaya because papaya is very good for the skin who have dull complexion, who have lots of sport or discoloration. If you have lots of discoloration, uneven tone, you can use papaya and it should be ripe and grate it along with its peel. Don't separate the peel. And this facial is very good. It's natural. The frequency should be twice a week in the beginning. If you have dull skin then I would say do it twice a week. And if your skin is normal then once a week will be okay. So do it at least for one month. That is four times in a month and I'm sure that you will be amazed by the result the skin will have a very even complexion the pore will be kind of diminished and the glow will be amazing and the glow remain quite long I mean it, the effect are quite long lasting it not, not just after 2-3 days you feel like it's again going to be dull because I have experienced this that's why I'm saying in my case the glow remain quite long I think after at least for two three weeks it still remain like I have done the facial just like two three days back it always feel like this 
and do this facial and uh, feel the result yourself and once the massage has been finished now we will apply the remaining pulp as a face mask so I'm applying with a brush if you don't have brush you can apply with your fingertips and once the face is fully covered with the pulp I leave it to dry and it will again take 10 to 15 minutes Now you can see in, it has dried not completely but yes majority I would say 75% it is dried you can see at some places it's completely dried so now I'm going to wash my face with warm water and after cleaning the mask I'm going to apply a toner I have made my own rose water toner and then I have freezed it into the freezer make it as a cube and now I'm going to apply this on my face just to close the pore. If you don't have any ice cube, you can put your normal toner. Or maybe for the future you can freeze rose water. That's very good for the skin. And now after applying my toner, I leave it pad dry. And once it has dried, now apply your favorite facial cream or moisturizer. And I'm applying my aloe vera gel as a moisturizer. Just take a small quantity and I'm applying on my face. And giving it a few second massage. So this finishes this fruit facial. And I hope you liked it. If you have any question, any query, please leave in the comment. And please give it a try and tell me the result, how you feel. And this is me after the final touch, after applying the final moisture, the moisturizer. Thank you for watching and thank you. Bye-bye. Have a nice day.